Hello my fellow smug ones. Well you might think why is an American getting involved in our royal traditions? But actually, she might have a point on this one. Let's begin. Okay, this story is from The Sun and it says, Palmer Anderson has asked Boris Johnson to swap the iconic bearskin caps on the Queen's Guards with fake fur. In a letter to Downing Street, the Baywatch star pleaded with the PM to save the bears by using manufactured hair instead. To be honest though, in this day and age, you would have thought they'd already be using fake fur, wouldn't you? Especially with all the animal protection charities about. She said, Petter and Ecopel have provided a solution. It would be unconscionable not to take it and continue to allow innocent animals to be killed when a humane alternative exists. That's actually a very good point, isn't it? And I can't see any reason why he wouldn't do it, although I'm guessing he now probably will do, especially if Kerry sees the letter. Renowned as glamorous blonde lifeguard CJ Parker for five seasons of Baywatch, Anderson now focuses on animal activism. In her letter to the PM, she called on him to demand the Ministry of Defence opt for alternatives to bearskin. The 54-year-old wrote, One of the reasons I like the UK is that it is a nation which prioritises animal protection issues. This makes it all the more outrageous that the caps worn by the Queen's Guard, a British icon, are still made from fur of bears which are killed in my native Canada. She reminded the PM of his promise to kick the habit when he was mayor of London, if it helped save a few bears. Well, I hope this letter has given you a massive kick up the bum and get on with it then, Boris. And I don't know how many Queen's Guards there's actually been over the years, but I reckon there's probably quite a large number of bears that have died needlessly especially in the last few decades, when I'm guessing alternatives could have been used. Anderson wrote, as you probably know, it takes the fur of at least one bear who was likely baited and gunned down to make just one of these ornamental caps. Some of these bears are nurse and mothers whose cubs will slowly die without them there to protect and care for them. Mr. Johnson, there is nothing more important for people in positions of power to do than to protect the vulnerable. The good news though is the PM himself has become a convert to their animal welfare cause since taking the top job. In 2019, his wife Carrie is a keen champion of animal rights and works for a conservation charity. You know, there's just no excuse for this, boss, and I think you should arrange for the fake fur to be used as soon as possible, because not only would it save bears' lives, but at the end of the day, I doubt hardly anyone would notice the difference in the way the hats actually look. YouTube's algorithm thinks you'd like to see one of these videos next, so let me know if it's right.